everybody, it's me, Ash, and today I am back with my final um, craft area tour slash revamp, I guess you want to call it. Um, so I did have to rearrange my living room area to do this. So um, I originally, my craft area started out over here. Instead, I put my TV and my kids' cubbies, um, and then I moved it to the other wall. So, this right here is where I moved it to. And you can see I got rid of that really big cabinet and I uh, got a couple shelves. So, um, I'm still figuring out my shelves. Um, but this is the gist of what it's going to be. I think I'm going to move this fast. Hold on. Okay. So, on this shelf, I have, like, extra, um, storage bins, like, um, let me see if I can find one, like, extra of these over here in the cart, of these containers, um, so, and, like, extra, like, stuff from Valentine's Day and whatnot. Um, this bin has, uh... in here oh okay this bin has extra um kids school supplies and stuff like that and then my my cutters um my printer um down here i have a basket of things people have gifted me this is the basket of all my stickers um down here i have my glitter paper my die cuts um, some extra things like vellum quotes and little tiny scrap pieces, some clothespins. This one right here is my mesh flowers and butterflies. Down here is pretty much like my mailing stuff, um, and my son's work folder that he does at home. So over here is my new desk that I got. Um, I got this at Harbor Freight for a hundred bucks. So I've been eyeballing it for about a year now and I finally decided to get it. Um, so I did use vinyl for the top to match the rest of my house. I have a little bit of extra left over. But up top here I have my pencil sharpener, my three hole punch. Some of my organizing drawers that have my gems and mini pins and random like little tiny things. Here is one of my 6x6 six six paper pad storage um, with my actual paper pads in it. I have my stapler and another organizer that has buttons and keychains and bookmarks and all kinds of stuff in there. My extra scrap paper one, my dex card one. My scissors, my tools for my jewelry, um, a couple shelves, my candies that I suck on because I quit smoking, my mats, and it looks like my daughter wrote me a little I love you card, some of my extra glues, my um, laptop, pictures of my kids, um, so yeah, and then this also has drawers, so I'm not completely entirely sure if this is how I want to keep it but here's like my bags and some of my pens these are my watercolor um paint brushes and these are my acrylic um just a few other little small extra things my washi tapes in there um over here is like all of my pens and pencils and markers so I have everything that goes with the Cricut over here all of my permanent markers here pens and pencils that I reach for every day and then like my gel pens and then extra pencils for the kids underneath I have my big shot I have um, my Christmas paper my vinyl my regular paper um, my my organizing filers for my son and the rest of the family Scrap wood, stuff I'm going to be mailing out soon, and my paints, and um, my cards and stuff like that. My, like, what do you want to call that? My card bases and everything are in that one. Um, 
over here, we'll start from top, is things I've made. Over here is things I still have to do videos about. Um, these two are ribbon and tool. And my bodabra and stuff for that. Here's my smaller ribbons and here I have my Cricut over here with the stuff for that. I have no idea what this is. Oh, okay, that's for my son's bouncy thing. <laughs> Didn't know how that got there. Down here is just extras of stuff. Um, this is like my wire and stuff like that and my chains for jewelry, my stamps, my inks, bath bomb stuff, stuff that I need to send out, random things for giveaways and stuff like that. Down here is all of my jewelry making stuff, so like my beads and my wires, um, like these right here, like those kinds for earrings and stuff like that, are all down in these baskets in my welding tool, my, well my soldering tool. And then you have my cart, which is stuff that I usually reach for all the time, down there. So up top I have some glitters, my glue tape, um, some of my adhesives, my punch. Down here would be like my flat back pearls, um, some of my paper flowers, um, all of my other embellishments. I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to store these chipboard things that I have right here that were in my one Tuesday morning haul. Um, and then down bottom is some envelopes, some brads, my paper punch, or my card envelope punch, and some more bags. So that is it for my craft area tour. I'm going to step back. I don't have very good lighting and it's early morning today, so um, yeah, that's what I have and this is what I work with. Um, I used to have to childproof it a lot for my younger son, but now he just is interested in things for a day or two. I'll have to tell him no and, you know, get his hands out of things. But then after that, he's usually not interested in this kind of stuff. He's more interested in his trucks and all that other stuff. So that is it, you guys, and I hope you like this video. Um, I'm going to be having... A giveaway challenge um, here shortly um, probably within a week because I want to be able to have it all done by the end of April so um, if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you're new to this channel please hit subscribe for more crafty related videos and until next time I hope you all have a wonderful day bye